Vandalism may force a small town furniture store to close. Someone broke into the store and caused thousands of dollars worth of damage. It happened at the furniture clinic in Medalia, Minnesota. That's southwest of Mankato. The owner says the intruder sawed through pieces of furniture and then poured paint on them. As Kate Raddatz shows us, the store represents much more than just a job to the owner. When Rick Elkins opened his store Monday morning, he knew something wasn't right. A oh, china hutch was, put, was dumped over, and that's what got my attention. What Rick couldn't see was this, the full extent of the damage. Rick is legally blind. He opened the furniture store last year when he could no I mean, longer do mechanical work. Your heart just sunk. You know, it's, this has been my baby. The vandals cut desks in half. These are all the empty cans of paint that we found. Paint poured on books, computers, even inside the refrigerator. I just couldn't believe somebody would do that. The remains of nearly 100 pieces of furniture were taken to a dump site down the road as community members helped clean up the mess. The community supports the Elkins family and everyone is just in shock that it happened. Rick estimates it would cost $8,000 to restock and clean up his store, money he doesn't have. And I have no insurance, so I don't know if we will get opened up again. Closing the store would not only take away a paycheck, but also the place that allows Rick to stay active in his community. It's hard to see them pick on, you know, someone with a disability like that. He's hoping someone will come forward with information. I've gotten a lot of support, and that's what everybody says for a small town like this, that nobody can believe that anybody in town would do something like that. Rick also served 10 years on city council and 20 years from the fire department. Police said they found one footprint as evidence but have no suspects right now. Anyone with information should call the Medelia police. Frank. Well, it's so wrong. I hope they get a lot of calls and find them. Absolutely. All right. Thanks, Kate. Mm -hmm.